You know, I just sold my house not too long ago um, for a very, very small profit, if any. But I came to realize that maybe house buying at all times is not a good decision some of the time, right? What is he talking about? Hey, Ross, where my money makes money, are you quick to buy a house? Now, I read some journals and I read a few news articles about how buying a house is not always a good financial decision. And the gist I got from it is that right now I'm in an apartment, okay? I'm in an apartment, two bedroom, two bathroom apartment, okay? And the only thing that's associated with all the bills when it comes to the rent is water. Water is connected with the rent. I pay for electricity and that is about it. Now, when I had my home that was three stories, four bedroom, four bathroom, I paid for water. I paid for electricity. I paid for garbage, okay? Am I missing anything? I know I'm missing, I feel like I'm missing another bill somewhere in there. But when you rent, you don't pay all those things. Now, some places you may pay water, you just have to kind of figure out what neighborhood you want to live in and what amenities they offer and do not offer. But if you're quick to buy a house, don't be, right? And I'm not saying waste all the money that you could be building within a house in your equity. It's timing. It's timing. If you know you're only going to be in a house if you were to buy one less than three years, it's probably not a good financial decision because the market swings according to the stock market, right? So we're about to move into a bearish market. You're gonna see that prices for houses, the value is going to dip, okay? The equity is going to dip. They're not gonna be worth as much as you think they're going to be worth. So if you know you're only gonna buy a house for three years, now granted, if you're in the market, if you're a real estate agent or you're a developer or you're into buying and selling real estate or you flip houses, this doesn't apply for you because you know the market better than anyone else. These are for novice or intermediate people who just want to buy a house for a couple of years and maybe move to another state, move to another area. I'm going to tell you this. Pause, stop, and think about it. Think about what I'm exactly what I'm saying. All the bills that are associated with the house. You have the mortgage. You have the insurance. You have water. You have electricity. You have trash. You have recycle. Uh... I'm, I think I'm missing a bill somewhere and I keep saying it, but the, nevertheless, there's a lot of bills associated with the house and a lot of those bills are services, okay? Services. What that means is that that money is not going to be inside of the house. This is just basically those bills monthly to keep your house running efficiently, right? You want water, you want electricity, um, you want people to come pick up your trash. Whereas an apartment, like I said, the water is connected to the rent, and then I just pay electricity. I don't pay a trash bill, okay? And then the bills are very minute. They're very small. For the last two months, my electric bill has been 45 50 bucks. That's for two months because I keep nothing on except for what I'm using, okay? Right now, I have a light on. It's, it's what I use is what I pay for. That's what I like. But when you're lighting a house or when you're heating or cooling a four or three story home or two story home, rather, or even a one story home, depending on the square footage dictates your electric bill. OK, then you, of course, having different occupants, people living in your house, family, friends, whatever, also dictates electricity and water as well. And don't forget, every time you turn on the hot water, you're paying for water and electricity. So if you're quick to buy a house, I want you to ponder. I want you to think. And I want you to write down, is it beneficial for me if I'm going to stay less than three years in a home? But if you're going to stay more than three years, it's beneficial because equity would have built inside that home and you will make a substantial profit if you or your real estate is a good negotiator. So if you're quick to buy a house, think about it. This is Ross World. I'm out.